Hey, Chris and Weirdos, hey, welcome back to our 550 Studio and TV Open Beta. In the last part, we played as Kuja from Final Fantasy IX, but now we're going to play as a totally new character in the studio, Ace from Final Fantasy Type Zero. Now, the interesting part about this is, is that Final Fantasy Type Zero, very first series I've actually done on my channel, like when I very first started out doing YouTube, Type Zero, I think it was the second series I've done on my channel, because the first one I've done was Fox was Revel Re Re Resident Evil Revelation 2. I partly did that on Twitch and on YouTube. Like, I played it mostly on Twitch, but I imported it from YouTube. The same thing I did was Type Zero, where I played it all on Twitch, but then I imported it from Twitch to YouTube. That's why, like, when you go watch my Type Zero like videos, you'll see it's a major difference from what I'm doing. That like, it's a like, if you ever watch like, watch this video. And then go watch my Fall Fantasy Type Zero video. You see a major difference in quality, major difference in audio. Like, I was just starting out. I was, like, awkward and weird when I just started out YouTube. But Type Zero, it has a phenomenal story. Like, I'm not going to spoil it for you. I'll leave a link to my Type Zero HD Remaster, like, play um, pl um playthrough in the description below. But it is, oh, if you're not crying by the end, it's like, it, it pull, it just... Like, I, I love the theme that Type Zero went with. I love the theme. I love the cat. The characters were amazing. I really wish they would make a sequel. Like, I heard they're making a sequel, but I, I'm like, I, I really hope they make a sequel. They really should, because, ooh, I want to spoil it, but, ooh, Type Zero got me on the heart string. It got the feel. It gets you right in the feel. So I really want to see how, like, characters from Type Zero, like Ace, will play out in the studio. Because Ace, like, I actually love using Ace. Like, in Type Zero, I actually love using Ace. I think my favorite character was Jack. Jack my favorite character to use. He was slow but powerful. Ace, he was like, he was a medium. He was like, kind of like, eh, he's kind of in between. Do we have a Type Zero map? No, we don't have... No, we don't, we don't have a Type Zero map? Alright, so... Let's go with... Let's go, let's go now. I'm like, oh, we don't have a Type Zero map. That's sad. We, oh, uh, yeah, definitely Alexander. Because I don't think Alexander was a summon in Type Zero. Like... I would love to play that. Like, I would love to play that. Like, if Type Zero has a DLC, I would love to play that. I would love to do a Type Zero DLC. Because that, like, it was just... It was, it was, it was, it was, it was like it was, it was like an underdog. It was like a Final Fantasy underdog. It's a beautiful day for a oh, fuck. Oh, shit! Clouds off it! You don't stand a chance. Like, Type Zero, it was like one of those, like, Final Fantasy games where, like, it was just... It was like an underdog, like... It was shit on just for being different. Like a lot of people shat on Type Zero when it came out for PSP because it was different. But the people, like some people, gave it a chance. Like I gave it a chance. It was actually pretty good. Like if you give certain Final Fantasy games a chance, like if you give like Final Fantasy is one of those, those one of those series where even though like it has like spinoffs and sequel like spinoffs and like no games that aren't like main like aren't like, aren't like main like aren't like like in the main number series. Even like no, if you give it a chance. Like, it's actually pretty fucking good. Yeah. But, like, yeah, Type Zero, like, only one Final Fantasy game where, like, I can see, like, why the people don't like it. I think it was the Crystal Chronicles. Though, yeah, I can bloody well see why people hate that shit. I played it and that was, like, wait, I'll fire RF. Ugh. Ugh. Oh, they're all targeting my ass. Shit, they're all targeting my ass. Ooh. I like that, Jack. I kind of like that thing like that. Yeah! Da 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 da. Yeah! Come here! I'll destroy you with magic cards! Yeah! So straight with Yu-Gi-Oh! Son of the morning! Ugh. Ash Blossom! Ah! No! You didn't gain it by Ash Blossom! Oh yeah, luckily, I have a Kaiju! Okay. I have my ultimate weapon! Yeah! Nope, nope, fuck, he negated that shit. Yeah, yeah. Yeah! Chaos Max! Go! Yeah. That's right, bitch. Summon. You know what so funny, though? When you use Ace, every time you use Summon, like, Ace goes down. I mean, I mean, I mean it's just because that's how you use Summon in Type Zero. Like, you have to sacrifice a party member in order to use a Summon. Which is kind of BS. But, like, when you think about how much summons can turn the tide of battle, it kind of makes sense. It was, it, it was interesting, because, like, 
you want to use summons because they're powerful, they're powerful as hell. You want to use summons, but it came at a cost, so you had to strategize. You're like, hmm. what, like, you know, battles you know, not really turning in my favor. Should I sacrifice a party member or use a summon? Or should I treat this party member? Because maybe this party member may help me out double line. Like, you know, it's kind of so difficult. Like, I, I, how you, like, had, like, you know, certain battles, so you had to have certain party members. Like, it was. All I say is, like, Titan Zero was, was a different, it was interesting kind of Final I wish we would have done more Final Fantasy like that. Like, Final Fantasy that had to do with, like, war and all that. I wish they would have done more, like, Final Fantasy 15. They sort of, like, it wasn't as, like, like, they should have done some similar to that, like, Final Fantasy. Like, maybe like, as, like, a DLC. Maybe not, maybe not in the, oh, oh, cross one. Maybe not in the main game, but maybe, like, a DLC where it had to be. Ah, that, you know what? And then Chaos Max! Go! Ugh. Oh! <laughs> Chaos Max Blue? I was gonna use Kaiju next, but okay. I was gonna use Kaiju Blue. Oh, Sephiroth! Hey! Ta da! Oh, my match card. Alright. Mission complete. complete. <laughs> and that you so sad to know that, like, uh, It hurts because I know what happens, I don't know what happens to Ace with all of them at the end, but it's like, oh! Oh! Oh, 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 oh. So that was Final Fantasy, that was Ace from Final Fantasy Type Zero. So that was all the characters playable in the in the closed beta, all the characters playable in the open beta. Let me know, guys, who was your favorite character so far? Like, who's your favorite character in Final Fantasy City NT? So, Final Fantasy City NT comes out on January the 30th. And I already got my shit pure. I already pure that. I already have that shit ready to go. You already know to find your Final Fantasy, to see the NT walkthrough, to find any video on the Final Fantasy NT, you know where to go. The awesome man. You know all that comes to me from Final Fantasy. I am the Final Fantasy nerdist. Like, oh, oh, get ready, guys. January 30th is gonna be lit. It's gonna be mwah, GG lit. So thank you all for watching. Don't forget to click the subscribe button. And that cool little bell thing outside, so I can stay updated on all the cool Final Fantasy stuff happening on my channel. And get ready for and get ready for my Final Fantasy walkthrough, Final Fantasy City NT walkthrough, and and a bunch of random like Final Fantasy streams coming January 30th. And may the light of the crystal be with you all.